Baltimore, show a brother some love. Yeah, that's right. Happy to see y'all, man. Y'all happy to see my black ass? Huh? Uh, y'all kind of tight up in here, man. Y'all all right? Yeah, I see you playing. Got your brew, got your lady with you. Get ready to get a lap dance, ain't you? Yeah, with your old self. Look at you. I seen you popping them Viagra pills in the bathroom. You better watch them, girl. Ain't nothing funny about a four-hour erection. He gonna ride you like the Preakness, girl. It's gonna be like the Pimlico. Ah, giddy up, giddy up. Be like the Pimlico. Right. Ah, giddy up, giddy up. We at the player. The prayers club. Thank you. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be all right, brother. It's gonna be all right. Uh, yeah. Hear what he said. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the uh, queen of bees. Well, she's a busy soul. She uh, has no time for birth control. That's why, in serious times like these, there are so many sons of bees. What about the bear? I mean, y'all serve alcohol up in here. That's why they say reading is fundamental. What does it say? <laughs> Ginger beer? Yeah. Unbelievable. It's non-alcoholic. What about this? Holy oil? What did you think this was? Lubrication. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Good morning. Um, I came in the front door this time, so I... Can... I can see the sign. I can see it was the prayers, the prayers club. Look, um, it's a peace offering. I am trying to help you use your mouth as an instrument of praise. See, all they talk about using my mouth as an instrument is why I thought I was in the players club in the first place. See, I'm glad you have accepted my challenge. I'm going what? to clear what? my schedule for uh -huh. the next three days and spend it with you. No, I ain't, I ain't say nothing about accepting no challenge. And I'm mm -hmm. going on vacation. I'm not wasting my vacation with your uptight Christian butt. We know y'all Christians don't know how to have fun. No, that ain't going to happen. Uh -huh. Did you say Christians don't know how to have fun? Did you say Christians don't know how to have fun? Yes, I did. That's what I said. Oh, see, somebody done told you wrong. Because I'm having more fun now since I got saved than I have ever had out in the world. Oh, so now... I guess I have a challenge because you got that all twisted, bro. Oh, yeah, we're going to have some fun. <laughs> so, you be here tomorrow at 10 a.m. Oh, oh, oh. Did you say 10 a.m., like, like 10 a to the m? That's right. That's hell to the no. That's what that is. I don't get up early. I work at night, remember? The only time I get up early is if somebody come to my house with a uniform, a badge, and a gun, and some papers, and say I need to be in court. Other than that, I don't get up. So you're going to see me 10 to the P to the M. That's when you're going to see me. Hmm. Are you scared I might rub off on you? No. I was hoping you would. Good. So be here bright and early. And you know, you might look pretty decent in a suit, so wear one tomorrow. Okay? <laughs> you know what? I get it now. I, I, I'm, I'm on to your game. You know what? Ten you think you're slick, don't you? You think it's you fine and you got your own business and you compliment a brother every once in a while. He's just going to do whatever you say, huh? Ten o'clock. Well, let me let you know something, Miss Taylor. You be careful, okay? Because I might just rub off on you. See you tomorrow. <laughs>
3, verses 9 and 10. Are we there? Yeah. Say yes if you are. Yeah. Okay. We praise our Lord and our God. And with it, we curse men who have been made in God's likeness. Out of the same mouth come praise and curses. My brothers and sisters, this should not be. This is the word of God, and it is blessed. I have good news. The steak isn't ready yet. Isn't that bad news? Nope. Why not? Because the cinnamon Danish pancakes are. See, that ain't what I ordered, man. That's why I don't like it. That's why I don't like supporting black establishments, because y'all always trying to do something shady. That's why I go to the friends. That's a bad business. <laughs> do you want to wait on the steak, or do you want to try these? Take my word for it, they are delicious, okay? Please, man, I ordered. Heavenly Father, <laughs> we glad you would come before you say, thank you for the school, Jesus. Yes, and bless the hands that have prepared. Amen. And very kind of strong as well with you. Know what I mean? like that. I don't know why you gonna ask me what I want if you ain't gonna give me what I want. You, you should have just said we got fruit loops. Uh, <laughs> Damn. These are delicious. Mm -hmm. Y'all give me them. Mm -hmm. See, you know, sometimes when we ask for isn't the best thing for us, and when God gives us something different, He's saying try it. You just might like it. Do you think everything has a spiritual connotation to it? I know that God speaks in many different ways and we have to have our spiritual ears and eyes open to hear what he may be trying to tell us. We missed the signs. For example, you were offended that what you asked for wasn't what you got. So you mean to tell me God sent me these pancakes? <laughs> or you just ran out of steak and eggs? <laughs> I'm telling you that a spiritual response is always better than a natural one, but it takes practice. You know, the natural response is to let our emotions guide our behaviors, and the spiritual response is to look and see what the message may be. But I know what the message is. I'm fit to put a hurting on these pancakes. They good as a mother father. They <laughs> 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 almost good as my grandmother. Sorry, Grandma. Well, good. I'm glad you like them. So now I guess it's time to go walk off some calories at the harbor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, next example. What do you see? A blind man if he were her. No, what do you see when you look at her? You know you don't want me to answer that. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. All right, I, I, I see a woman. Okay. They look like she ate all the damn ravens. That's who I see. You see how fast she was? Huh? She stepped on the scale and say one at a time. What I see. I see layers of duckling feathers covering a beautiful swan structure underneath. All she needs is a little encouragement. Right, I, I agree. See, we're making progress. God right. answers prayers. I saw layers too. Layers of fat. <laughs> she looked like the Michelin man. You know what she looked like? You ever get them biscuits and you bang them on the side of the table and the fat busts out the side? That's what her butt looked like, that biscuit fat. That was layers, all right. Body looked like mashed potatoes. Lord. Why did you assign me to him? What? It was fantastic.